Wanted to know if there's enough salt, brine, and crews to treat the roads. CBS 17's Haley Fixler went to NCDOT's maintenance yard to check. Governor Cooper checked out the salt barns. They are all stocked and ready to go. He also checked out these trucks that you see here behind me, waiting for those drivers to take them along the roads and pre treat them with brine. They have 500 employees working to spread more than one and a half million gallons of preventative solution across the state. They also have all of this salt stored in the barn for when they need to add more to the roads to prevent icing. And when the snow hits, they're going to have 1,100 employees ready to help clear the roads. And all those crews are actually at home resting right now. So when they get the call that they need to get the roads open and safe for people to travel tomorrow, they will be ready. Governor Cooper said he was appreciative of everything crews have had to do with this unprecedented back to back to back storms. A lot of them are resting right now because they're getting ready to go back out there. But we're grateful for the hard work of our DOT employees, particularly when, uh, as with most other industries right now, there is uh, a shortage of staff. So the people who are here have to work that much harder. Uh, in the past two events that we have had in the last few weeks, uh, they've done extraordinarily excellent work. And we expect them to do that again here and to get us through the weekend. Now, I did ask DOT officials if there was any problems getting supplies or if there's any parts of the state that were having troubles getting all of these supplies. I was told no, which is great, but they are still asking everyone to stay off the roads if they can and let the crews do their jobs. In Raleigh, Haley Fixler, CBS 17 News.